<clears throat> All right, we are back with Planet Crafter. Last time we left off right after finishing building the two nuclear reactors. Now we have lots of power to go ahead and expand. What would we need to do to get the drill? So we want the ore extractors. Unlocks at 150. And that's actually coming fairly soon. But we're also going to want the tier 2 and the tier 3. Tier 3 is at 13. Well, we've got to go a long ways with pressure. So. Yeah, we'll, we'll go at least to that and then reassess what we're going to do after that. So, we need drills. To build drills, we need iron, iron, titanium, aluminum, aluminum. How's our aluminum supply? A bit. We can use all of those. Oh, I have chips in my inventory that I haven't checked on. Big living compartment. Nice. And GPS satellite. Those are both useful. Big living compartment. The most so, cause, so I don't have to build these weird squares. I can build the bigger sections now. Okay, so we're going to build a couple of more drills. Drills needed. Iron, iron, titanium, aluminum. Yeah, so we need iron now. No iron there, iron here. I don't need the magnesium. Right, that'll let me build a couple of them. short on titanium. Nothing's in the way. So let's go look for some titanium. Oh, we got the launch pod platform unlocked. That's important to uh, do multipliers on the Well, it basically multiplies our the production of our different uh, things like the drill and the um, veg tube things and all of that stuff. It multiplies them, so it makes everything go much, much faster. Let's look around down here for more iron. Is the roommate knocking on the door again? Hello? Maybe I'm just imagining things. Or maybe there's a sound in the soundtrack that sounds similar that I'm mistaking. Oh, oh, oxygen low. No. 
I had to do some synchronizing because this webcam is delayed by 800 milliseconds for some reason. And I had to figure out how much the delay was and then compensate. And Alright, that's used up all of our spare aluminum. Let's see, how fast is the pressure growing now? Pressure is growing up by 100 nanopascals per second. Which is nice, but nowhere near the sp to what we need to, in order to get to the higher tier. Ooh. To whoever receives this message, I'm a planet crafter sent to the Mygora. My. My. Gorea. My Gorea 3 planet. If you've received this, that means that you are near. Maybe you are a planet crafter as well. The weather is atrocious and I'm running out of resources. There's not enough on this barren world to terraform it. I don't know why I chose this. Death would have been more pleasant than this hell. If anyone can send me help, please do. Message from Riley. I managed to main obtain more information. I read that you have a greater chance of success if you build your base at an altitude. I'm not sure why yet. And if you should manage to heat the planet up enough, some caves should become accessible when the ice melts. One last thing you can... dot 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 dot. End of communication. Message interrupted. Yes, that is why we did not build our base down there. Hopefully this is high enough elevation. Yeah. I'm pretty sure it is. We will find out. Okay. So this is going up rapidly. We'll soon have this unlocked. Flower pots, heaters, water collector, water life collector, tree spreaders. Okay, what do I need for the launch platform? Bunch of super alloy. Do I have any of that left? I'm gonna use it all up. I did use it all up. I can make super alloy, but that takes a lot of resources. Hydration level critical. So what we'll do for now is put away all the things that we don't need to be carrying around. Make another oxygen just in case we need it. lots of super alloy up there so if we run around to the other side we should be able to get some it's a little bit of a walk but it's not too far if you find this interesting be sure to like the video and maybe subscribe for more stuff in the future all kinds of fun stuff that I do here. This is actually the second in the series of Planet Crafter version 1.0. What are they doing up there? Up there? That's a weird glitch. I'm already filling up my inventory with extra stuff that I didn't don't really need when I'm trying to get super alloy, but oh well. Last time the objective was to make up the sky blue, and we did that very nicely. Super alloy. There. 
I got four spots of inventory left. Yes, yes, oxygen level is low. Later on in the game, after it's not really too much useful to it, they start getting super alloy falling out of the sky. jump down here, see if there's some aluminum. No, I don't see anything. Oh well, let's run around the other side and build our... run back to the base. We've unlocked the drill, so... We should build some drills. What do we need to build a drill? Or, or extract drill? Oh, we need iridium rods. Okay, so we're gonna have to grab, go in there and grab a bunch of iridium. be nice once we get the jetpack and can go around much faster. Meteor shower. big thing, so let's just put it right here. So we can currently build asteroid attraction rockets, silicon, We need rocket engines. Conveniently, there's no fall damage. I've made a maze for myself. I can't get through there. to hmm. Is that enough for an iridium rod? Nope, need one more. Yes, that is the roommate. Yes, roommate, what do you need? I can't hear you, you have to open the door. Hello? Going crazy. Does the music have knocking noises in it? I 
don't know. Okay, so. What did these drop? Looks like just ordinary stuff. Drop everything off. How much uh, oxygen? I have one oxygen. That should be enough to go grab some iridium. Lava waterfall does look pretty. Or lava fall. If that's what it is. So do I need aluminum for that? Oh, I need osium too. I don't think I can get osium right now. I'm gonna need to heat up the planet more, more before I can get the drill. Yeah, see, this is, the store is blocked. Melts at 100 nano kelvin. We may have to hold off on the plans of building that and have to build a bunch of heaters first. And inventory is full.
Okay. Build one iridium rod. Put the rest away in here for now. What's our heat? We need a hundred nano kelvins, which is half of what we're at. Okay. So in that case, oh look at that! We're thirty-seven percent of the way to the rain. <laughs> yeah, the cleaning videos are actually really fun. Hmm. All right, we'll use our iridium rod on the. Rocket engine. What else do we need for rocket engine? Uranium. Okay, so first we're going to get the rocket engine, the rocket that drops uranium. And then we'll do the rocket that does iridium. So we need for the uranium rocket, we need a super alloy. We already have the cobalt we need. Yeah, that was a fun outfit that I had on that one. I lost that shirt somewhere. I don't know where, but I do miss it. I want to find another one. I'll also have to lose a bit of weight so that I can wear a shirt like that. <laughs> Alright, let's call down... Actually, let's first check the, uh, the display so I can show you how much it increases. So this is at 87, 9, and 108. 87, 9, and 108. 87, 9, and 108. Oh, I forgot the super ally. I thought I needed uranium. I don't need uranium, I need super ally. need uranium for the... rocket engine. Eighty-seven, nine, and one hundred eight. So we were at 87, 9, and 108. Now we are at 87, 93, and 108. It increased the heat by 10 times. Alright, ooh. Luckily those don't break anything. Get all the uranium falling from the sky.
So that rocket increased the heat multiplier by 10 times. Once these rocks unspawn a bit, I'll be able to grab a bunch of uranium out. the video lagging? Oh, it was for a second there. I have to wait for these rocks to go away. Alright, we'll go look down here. Refill the oxygen when we're in the... as we pass the drop capsule. Oxygen refilled. I can't reach all of the pieces yet. It's somewhat annoying, but oh well. Oh, inventory is full. Why did I bring along a whole bunch of stuff I don't need? Inventories are getting a little full. Still too many ro big rocks. I'm not sure what the time limit was on this, but that's somewhat annoying because I can't really get up to my base very well. Well, it's, it's, it's happening. Somewhat happening. Go over and grab the golden capsule effigy underneath the rock here that we saw earlier but didn't pick up because they had too much stuff in the inventory. And then I think I'll make an iridium rocket. If I can get onto the rocket launch pad. I have water on me. So first we need rocket engine that requires an iridium rod. And there we go. Now we have... We need this here. And I think it's magnesium we need. We'll find out.
This did have to crash right on top of my... Oh my goodness. Oh no, it's silicon. Here I'm complaining about the rocks covering everything and I'm about to call down more rocks. Oh, it's almost up there. There we go. Okay. And we gotta get to the rocket launcher button. It's underneath this giant rock. Oh dear. The rocket is going sideways. Because of the rocks on the launch pad. No matter. Which snow shoveling? Is that the one where it was, uh. Oh, the, uh. Snow shoveling out of somebody's future bedroom? And yeah, that's. that's pretty much it. Die. I find the harder it is you work physically, tends to be the lower amount of pay. The more you work, for, the more you work hard, the less you get paid, or something like that. Okay, so the previous one over here that we were harvesting has. dissolved a bit. Maybe it's because it's not raining. That's why the... Maybe the rocks are programmed not to, di to disappear very quickly unless it's raining. I do not know. But I do know I need an iridium rod for every rocket, which means for now I'm going to have to drop a bunch of iridium rockets just to be able to keep up dropping rockets. Oh, oh no.
Oh, well, it's my, my, um, thanks for letting me know. The, uh, audio recorder seems to have stopped being paused. It's supposed to, I'm using an audio recorder to get, to bring my audio in properly, and if it's, I guess if you leave it unpaused for 40 minutes, it stops. enough that I can just build another box. I can build a box, just put it right here. And have this be the Iridium box. Should be able to hear me now. Double checking. Yeah, yeah, you can hear me now. Go pick up stuff off the ground. I'm just going to ignore that section for now. It's starting to look shiny. The sand is wet. bunch of it right just lying around here. There's no puddles yet, but there will be soon. We are full again. Terraforming index is going up a lot quicker, a lot faster now, a lot more quickly. Yeah, look at that. Pressure's going up. Oxygen's going up. Okay, so I just grabbed a bunch of iridium. Okay, now we gotta use some of these resources because there's 
they're getting filled up. They have definitely have enough to build another nuclear power plant. We're going to need them. Oh, we need super alloy for that. Uh, that podcast, uh, I do the podcast every Monday morning. That one is from the 8th of January, I think. I'm about, I'm a bit behind on publishing them. <laughs> I've got a bunch of them that will be published shortly. Ooh, tier 2 is ready. Okay, so that's cool. But I can't make explosive powder without building this first. So, oh yes, I love I love different hair colors. So I need a Lerma. That's a Shanga. Here's a Lerma. Lerma seed. What else do I need for the biodome? I need titanium and cobalt and aluminum. Aluminum. Cobalt, some titanium, we're gonna need iron. Where are we at here? Need one more cobalt. The blues and purples are my favorites. Yeah, so. Cobalt. Uh, 2001 is when we moved to Canada. Okay, so that worked, but why isn't it letting me build it? Getting some intersection, I think. Stuff in the way. Some redesign is going to be necessary. Okay, maybe I'll build it on top. build on top. What are we intersecting with? All the power. Oh no, I'm dancing again. Stop dancing. Okay. That's interesting. The arrow keys are causing dancing and I'm not wanting to be dancing. We're out of oxygen. I'm going to move these over here for now.
Alright, so let me build it now. Yes. Okay. That's better. New blueprint, flower pod. Of course, I can't get in there. <laughs> Is the veg tubes in the way? All right. Okay, pushing number three is not the. No, don't deconstruct the foundation underneath this. <sighs> okay, this is not what I thought it was. I was expecting a construction. Oh, you can't tell that I deconstructed the foundation grid. We'll just pretend it didn't happen. Indeed. But the problem is, these rocks are going to be in the way. I'm going to have to expand this way, because I can't move the rocks. Which means I'm going to need to put a, a square here, and then go out that direction. But I also I need this iridium that's floating in the air. But... And all the iridium that's lying around the ground. <coughs> okay. What I need now the most is make some water, eat some food. Now, I need some iron. Yeah, it is coming along nicely. Got silicon, ice, cobalt, titanium, magnesium. Where is the iron? There's some iron. And there's some iridium, a lot of iridium lying around here. A bunch more over here. Inventory is full. I wish it would rain more often. Oh, flower spreader. That means we can start planting flowers outside. What do we need for the tier one flower spreader? We need super alloy fertilizer. We can't make fertilizer yet. I need to find the building that allows, allows me to do that. Oh, I can't get through there. No, that's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> oh dear. 
Well, I guess we're rebuilding our foundation grid. Oh, there's stuff in the way. Uh, I'm gonna put here. that I got. I wanted to deconstruct one of those. Rebuild. Where is it here? Biodome. Build. Well, I'm living apartment. I need more iron. What am I? Inventory. Okay. We'll hunt for iron again. <laughs> Flower boxes would be nice. All right, we got some more iron now. Eventually, there'll be frogs and fishes and new animals. That's the stuff that's new in this this version. There's animals now. Oxygen level low. Dust like that. Okay, what am I missing? Corner, with the big one. We have glass on the bottom, biodome. Alright, I'll build, I guess I'll build the water. Maybe that's part of what I'm forgetting. I'll build the water collector. Yeah, some of the frogs are actually really cute. Water collector. Okay, I need super alloy. Do I have super alloy? Or have I used it all? I think I've used it all. Okay. I can actually make super alloy. And now do I have... I need another aluminum now. Water collector is going to go right here. Okay, it's not going to go right there. It's bigger than I remembered. That'll do there. Uh, swimming pool would be nice. 
There, okay, so we have a water collector now. That was not what's waiting, we were waiting for. Alright, let's see. What are we lacking here that we need? Ooh, we can build a new backpack fairly soon. Feeder, sign, biodome. Machine optimizers. I don't remember where do you make the Let's go look at the biodome again. Is there a s No, there's just the one interface. Oh wait, let's look at the interface here. Yes, okay, so I need the bio lab. In order to get the bio lab, I need to have biomass on the planet. In order to have biomass on the planet, I need to build something related to trees or, s or grass. Oh, I need a grass spreader. So, I need water, water, magnesium, aluminum, and a lerma. Lerma. Magnesium, aluminum, water, 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 let's have a check, can we build the grass better? Yes, we can, okay. Let's see, let's put some grass over here. Well, we are adding oxygen to the atmosphere, which is going to be reacting with, with hydrogen in the atmosphere to make water, as well as um, calling down asteroids, I guess, to bring uh, high water. Let's see, to collect any? Yeah, look, it collected water, even though it's not raining. Okay, we built a grass spreader. How fast is the biomass growing now? Seven grams. Okay, 7.9 grams per second, and then we needed how many grams for the biolab? 800 grams. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna increase our grass spreading. What do we need? Magnesium, aluminum. Do we need grass spreaders again? Oh, we need lermas too. Ooh. How many lermas? Oh, we only have one lerma left. So that's not going to do like I'd hoped. So we'll build one. Do we have anything else to make biomass? We don't have a tree spreader yet. Food grower, ore extractor, launch platform. Well, we'll make it with grass for now. We built a tier 3 heater. Have we built any? T yeah, we built one tier 3 heater, I think. Or did we? I think not, actually. Alright. In order to do more expansion. We need more foundation. If we get more foundation, we need more space. If we get more space, we need to make an uh, uranium rod. I'll put the water in there. That's a tier 2 heater. What do we have here that I haven't made yet? Have the we already have the tier three backpack. We need fabric for agility boots. Okay. All right. So what we need is more iron.
Oh, that sounds tasty. Uh, my roommate made this actually really nice Korean ramen. It came with many things that... It was many flavors that had cucumbers and other vegetables in it. It was very tasty. I don't know all the details are which here. Oh look, some water. We've actually got water here we now. We got puddles. And this is why we did not build the base down here. Lots of iron, yay. Your inventory is full. But crustless quiche sounds quite good as well. Well, it made one splashing noise there. Let's see. It's not quite enough water to make splashing noises, apparently. We definitely need more heat. So this area can all be more base, which would require me to move all of this stuff, but I'm going to do it anyway. Almost out of auto. Okay. Since our nuclear reactors make so much more energy than the solar panels, we might just repurpose things. Ooh, tier 5 backpack available. What do I need for the tier 5 backpack? Always need more backpack. We need... What? Oh, we, we've unlocked the tier 5 backpack, but not the tier 4 backpack? <laughs> That's funny. Where is the tier 4 backpack? Here, signs. Butterfly parks, fabric, silkworms, food, larvas. I don't know. But somehow we've unlocked the tier 5 backpack, but not the tier 4 backpack. That's weird. Okay, so I won't worry about the backpack right now. What have I got in? Oh, I have iridium that I do not need to be carrying. Well, I guess we're making an iridium rod. And a uranium rod. Okay, 
all these things are gonna be in the way. What does that give me? A one iron. Okay, yeah. So we get rid of all these wind turbines because we're not gonna be needing them anymore. They make barely any power compared to the nuclear power reactors. Nuclear power reactors. Where are we gonna put those? I'm gonna put them right here, actually. Let's see. Make sure I have enough space. What do I need for the tier 2 reactor? Oh, explosive powder, which I do not have. Cannot build explosive powder yet. I'm used to the one button to be able to change the the buttons, but that's not what's happening when I push the one button. Okay. So I want to move all this stuff. I now have a full inventory. So I'm just gonna drop a box here for now while I'm doing this. and stuff will go here. Do I have? Yes, I do have foundation grid so I can rebuild. Actually, I might need the iron for the... Yeah, I needed that iron. Okay, let's, let's go grab an iron. Oxygen level critical. Yes, I'm planning to do that actually. I've got um, three or four of them ready to go right now that I'm working on uploading and writing the title and names and stuff on. But yeah, they're, they're basically ready to go. I need more iron. I've got one that's already uploaded, it just needs its title and description edited. And then I've got three that need to be uploaded. And have the title and description added. And then I've got like eight or ten of them that need edited. It doesn't take too long to edit them, maybe like 20-30 minutes. But there's eight or ten of them, so... I'm working on hopefully like four to five a week right now. That's an unoptimistic goal. We'll see how that goes. Just to be able to get caught up with them. Yeah, right, that doesn't look so wrong now. What is it intersecting with? I guess the rock. Oh yeah, it won't let me build it into the rock. Yeah, that's a good thing that we decided to go sideways already. Oh, 
need more water. Do you have any super ally? No, we need titanium. Not ice. How many do I need for another nuclear reactor? I need two more. and grab some magnesium. There are some right there. And that should allow me to build the rest of the super alloy so that I can rebuild another nuclear power plant instead of all of those turbines. Oh my goodness, it's dark in here. Okay, do I have enough now? Yes, I do. Okay. Oh, I can't build it that close to the whirly gig. Okay, just going there for now. I'll figure it out later. Okay. Now, I want a large living space, which requires more super alloy, more iron, more titanium. How many super alloy? I think it was three. No, just two. Good. Take that. Take that. I need some magnesium. in here. Oh, I need titanium. Hey, Stefan, how's it going? Good to see you again. Always nice to hear from you. How have things been doing for you lately? Big that is. Let's go inside. Oh ho! Big living compartment. All right, let's move our.
There we go. <laughs> 75 hours to talk. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel you there. Yeah, sure. Well, get in talk connect with me. Look me up on Facebook or something or WhatsApp if you still have my number for WhatsApp. Uh, you're welcome to contact me anytime. We can chill, get coffee if you want, or some other beverage. That'd be cool. Okay. This, this needs to be moved over a little bit. Yeah, there. Now it's not intersecting the wall. I now live much closer to where the old shop was, so... If you're anywhere near the old shop, it's probably, you're probably near me, so... You would be... Probably pretty easy to figure something out. Um, do I? S I'm not sure. I don't talk to very many people very often that we knew then. Okay, Orleans. Yeah, that's a little bit of a trick, but it's not. It's pretty fast to get to the train from here, so. You can figure it out. Yeah, I understand. Oh, I can build the agility boots. I've been sitting on an extra fabric here this whole time. Okay, so we just need super alloy again. Uh, magnesium, or aluminum, aluminum. We have magnesium. We need all the other stuff. Oh, yeah. Uh, I tried to keep in touch with them, but I don't know. It has, it ne never worked out. So, I don't know what they're up to anymore. He offered to let me come over and use his internet once or twice, and I, then I asked if I could come by, and I never heard from him again. So I don't know. <laughs> All right. Yes, yes. I, I love the trains. <laughs> Have a good night, man. everything I need. I think so. We'll find out. Pick up random stuff on the way back. We're starting to get grass here. Look at all that grass. Beans. Eating the beans. Okay, 
what else did I need for the legs? Nothing. Alright. We can now run a little bit faster. Woohoo! Nice. Okay. What are we needing now? Because. Heat is going up fairly quickly. Hmm. Marium drone station. Oh yes, yeah, so okay, so let's check on what is our biomass accumulation doing right now. Spreading grass. How's the grass spreading going? Biomass is at 408 grams, and we needed, what, 600 or 800 or something like that? Okay. We need... 865 so we're getting there not too much farther before the biomass is enough that we're able to build the bio lab the bio lab is probably going to go right here if it fits what I'm going to do for now Oh, there's no iron in there. I need iron. Lots of iron. It looks to me like the water has spread a lot, even though it's barely rained. Lots of water now. Oh, we're swimming. Iron. Yeah, it is somewhat similar. I've never actually played No Man's Sky. I was really interested in, to, in it until I saw how many people were angry about it. So I never got around to buying it. This one you only have one planet and you're terraforming it. So like this, none of this water was here um, when I started this playthrough. It's all accumulated since then. Uh, right now I am collecting iron to build some containers. Because I'm tired of running around between containers. It is kind of similar to Subnautica as well. I've played that a little bit. My ex had it, but I didn't get to play it very much. I've seen a friend, or not a friend, I watched a Jacksepticeye play it a bit, quite a bit. There is currently no other mod, as far as I'm aware of. I'm the only mod. I'm not sure what you're referring to. Oh, 
I have not assigned moderator status to anyone. Yes, indeed. I don't think Heidi is a moderator. Does it say Heidi's a moderator? Did I click that by mistake at some point? But I'm confused. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I've given anybody moderator status on this channel. Oh, no, it's all good. Yeah, Heidi is, um, all she ever does is watch my videos, it seems. She does nothing else except for wait for me to make a video and watch it immediately and make a comment. <laughs> it's kind of impressive. is low. Must hurry and get back to base. Run. Run. Made it. Okay. So what else are we going to put in these boxes? Okay. Cobalt, magnesium, titanium. Silicon, titanium, silicon, cobalt, magnesium. so that we can build one or two more boxes. This is not iron, but apparently I'm picking it up anyway.
<laughs> sure. Sounds good, Stefan. Um, you mean all the comments that you posted on a specific channel? Like an activity feed? Yeah, um, I'll, I'll let you know if I figure that out. I feel like there might be somewhat of a way, but also I feel like it might not be possible. I'm not entirely sure. Yes, shivers, ASMR, stuff like that. Aluminium. Alright, that's a little better. So now, oh, the bean isn't grown. What's our biomass at yet? <laughs> oh, yeah. Fun times. Okay, 710. Oh, we're almost there. Okay, I need... Do I have ice? Yes, I picked up ice. Now I'll drink the water. Okay. <laughs> no, it's all good. The conversation makes it more interesting. Otherwise, I'd be just sitting here playing the game by myself without saying anything. Okay, I want to build another power plant, but I don't have... Let's see, power plants require, I think, three? Um... Yeah, they do take three super alloy. So that means I need to do this. One, two, three. 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 Yeah, it goes up and down. I'm not sure how that's supposed to work. Sometimes it says... I don't understand why it does that. Okay. I need water bottles. Which should be in here. Yes. The atmospheric water collector is working as intended. I'll put it here for now. Good enough. And how much power do we have now? And I want to build a ladder to get on top of my base. Let's see. We'll do this. Yes, okay. Ah, see, there's, there's stuff up here. Stuff up here to pick up.
nothing else. Okay. So now, how much more do we need? Almost there. <laughs> uh, good night, Stefan. See you soon. While oh, we're waiting, let's build up. Iridium, okay, we need iridium rod titanium. Do I have aluminum? Yes, I do have aluminum. Alright, so the, this heater can go outside. We'll put it over here. We may have to rearrange stuff later, but for now we'll just. Oh, does this have to be done inside? Weird. I thought I could put this heater outside, but I guess not. There's one right there. How's our heat? Oh, the heat's going up fast, much faster now. The pressure is not going up very quickly compared to what it was doing. stuff we can, not very much, but I'll put it away so I can run over and grab some of the last coal. Okay, no cobalt and magnesium. I have silicon. I have not yet built a thing to hold the iron because it's very rare to have enough extra iron to think about putting it in a box. is getting deeper the capsule is half underwater. Let's see if we go it can still get in a capsule. <laughs> I don't see any more uranium or iridium or anything lying on the ground. Was quick. Titanium, silicon. Now we can build our iron box. It almost lines up. Good enough. Let's put these way in there. Oh, biolab. Okay, the biolab is ready. Build the biolab. I suppose I should have checked before leaving. 
Oh, we need Ozium. And we can't get Ozium until it's hot enough. So it looks like we're going to have to build some heaters. Or we could build another. Okay, what I'm going to do is um, build that rocket launch pad again. Rocket launch pad requires three super alloy. Okay, we, are, we are, I already know that we don't have enough iron. titanium and another iron. Alright, so we need three titanium and two, uh, one iron in order to build the rocket platform again. And we'll put it in a slightly different spot this time so that when the rockets come down at the exact same place every time, apparently, which is kind of weird, they don't cover up my rocket platform. Titanium. Titanium. Iron. Titanium. 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 Loss of titanium. Iron. Iron. And titanium. Okay, that's probably good for a few minutes. So where are we going to put our rocket launch platform this time? I think I'm just going to put it right here. If it will let me. Why won't you let me build? Yeah, good enough. So, we need more heat. In order to get more heat, that increases pressure, that increases heat. Okay, so we need cobalt, more super alloy, and a rocket engine. Build what we have when we can. Yeah. Uranium rod. Two uraniums. A rocket engine. Okay, so I need two more super alloy. means I need aluminum. That's what I'm short on right now. So I'm going to drop off the stuff that I have. We'll come back and pick it up later. Good enough. So we can grab aluminum in the section of weird asteroids over here. The cheese looking asteroids. Cobalt. 
Cobalt. Should have remembered to bring an oxygen tank. to base before we run out of oxygen. I agree. They do look scratchy. It's raining again. Okay, do I have what I need now? A rocket engine? Three cobalt? Okay, yeah, that should be enough. Beautiful rain. My favorite. What's our heat doing now? Heat is going up by 600 per second now. So, I want to build another one. I need an iridium rod. Do I have enough iridium to build a rod? Yeah, I do. And I also need silicon and titanium. Now what are we doing? 13.27 per second. Let's build one more. Let's see, 1327. Okay, so 1327. Now, if I build one more, we'll see how much it goes up by. I'm running out of space. I'm just going to put it over here for now. That put it up quite a bit. Okay, so let's... Iron and Cobalt. Do I have any iron? No, of course I don't have iron. Oh, 
That's interesting. The uh, asteroid bombardment waited until after the rain stopped. Really? Landed right on my platform again. Good grief. I want to add windows to the base, but I need a lot of iron to build windows, apparently. Look at that. Oh, we can see outside. We can see inside from inside. Haha, <laughs> through the outside. Okay. We need more heat. Well, in order to do more heat, we need... Actually, let's go over to that spot. Build a oxygen tank just in case. Oxygen. Grab something to eat. Grab a drink. Now we're gonna go and check out the spot where it said that it, the ice was going to melt. Cause I've forgotten what temperature the ice is gonna melt. We may have gotten to the required point. The ice melted. Okay. So in here, in this crater, we can find sulfur, but that's not what I'm interested in right now. Actually, we do need a little bit of sulfur for explosive powder, but... We can't even make the explosive powder yet. So I'm just going to grab couple of them for the trip. There, there we go, we'll take all of that. That's enough sulfur for now. Well, have a great night, Heidi. Thanks for being here again. I appreciate the company. Aha! The Ozium Cave is open!
When does this part melt? Five micro Kelvin. Got osium, a couple of osiums. I don't see any more osium to mine. We can build the automatic mining machine. I must run home because I'm running low on oxygen supply. <laughs> Have a great night. Inventory is full. Ooh, where did I find bioplastic? Cool. Alright, so now to build the automatic mining machine, I need an iridium rod. Super alloy and titanium. Almost out of iridium, that's okay because we're about to build an iridium mine. Did I have enough? Yes. Okay. It won't just mine iridium, but it will get a fair bit of iridium along with other stuff. <laughs> and immediately no power. Alright, let's go get this.
pick up some of this uranium so we can make a uranium rod for another power plant. see if I can figure out what it is that I'm waiting for to get the to be able to build the explosive powder. look through the things. Well, maybe it is the biolab. So now that I have osium, let's try crafting the biolab. No titanium left. that in here anyway. Okay. So I'll need titanium and whatever else to make some more super alloy. That should be what we need enough for to build the super alloy that we need to build the biolab. Okay, so three of that, three of that, three of that. Okay. Now for the rest of that, I need aluminum and I need. 
buzzer. Osmium. Okay. So this is a four part piece. Which I'd love to put there, but it's going to intersect. So. Nice to put it there too, but that's. Yes, I will put it there. Okay, so let's. Deconstruct these things. Why, why exactly can't I build that there? What is it intersecting with? That's stupid. Need more iron. Always need more iron. Let's me build there, but for some reason I can't build at all at this level over here. There's something weird going on. Something very strange. Oh well. So let's deconstruct this. Mm -hmm. 
Well, we have our biolab slightly offset. Alright, explosive powder. We need two sulfur and two iridiums. One iridium. Should be enough to build tier two. Oh no, I need one more uranium rod. Power is back on. How's our power consumption looking? 50 kilowatts available. Still have an explosive powder? Yes. Okay, so let's make another rod. And go deconstruct the two little reactors and make big reactors with them with their with their rods okay I have too much stuff in inventory by these two reactors and let's see how much extra power we have 200 kilowatts nice okay what do we need to do next in order to make things much easier I really want oh boy how far is it uh, let's just index and in order to get the index up that high we have to go a long ways we can build the algae generator now I don't have any eggplants. I suppose what I should do is go gather that um, uranium that's lying around outside. After that, we'll check on the iridium mine and see how it's doing. The water has gotten quite high. It's almost over the roof of the capsule.
Very nice. Let's see if the buried capsule is still operational. I'm curious. I should say the submerged capsule. It is not. I can no longer refresh my oxygen in the capsule. It is a new era. The base I built must be used from now on. Okay, oxygen is refilled. Let's see if we can find any more uranium lying on the ground from the last asteroid impact. There's a bunch up there, but I cannot get up there. I don't see any nearby. Oh, there's some. I'm just going to check in here again. I feel like sometimes they uh, objects respawn. I'm not sure. No, no respawn. Well, we have to get our terraforming index increased by a factor of 5,000 or so to get to the drones that I want to use. And I suspect we need many other things for that too. Right, let's go check on the iridium miner and then after that I think we're going to finish this episode. I wonder why I put it so far over here. It's because I want to build more of them all together on the same grid. And I need to have space for that. Okay, so it, it retrieved one iridium so far. Yeah. That's the thing with the lower tier miners, they just pick up random stuff. I mean, those things are useful, but it's also very slow. And not the greatest of stuff. Hmm. 
going to bring another rocket down. We're going to need another iridium rod, a rocket. Well, I uh, don't have enough iridiums for more rockets right now. We only have two iridium, and for a rocket, we need an iridium rod, which is nine iridium. So, yeah. It's going to be a little while before we can bring any more rockets. One iron. <laughs> well, this has been a good episode. We got through the rain and the liquid water stage, and we're getting closer to the lake stage now. Terraformation is happening fast enough, but definitely still not. Well, it's happening faster, but not fast enough. So, more rockets are required. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like, dislike, which everything is appropriate, and we'll be back again soon here.